everybody and welcome to the third scenario of our Francisco de Almeida campaign Runes and Vampires and we are moving to Africa somewhere around Somalia, Kenya it seems like let's see what this scenario has in store for us it was five years ago that I went with Don Francisco to the Indies his appointment to the Viceroy Ship of India by the young King Manuel had shocked the Portuguese court. Don Francisco was the champion of King Juan, the deceased cousin of the recently crowned king, and the Almeidas had favored a rival claimant to the Portuguese throne. The king's intentions were the topic of many hushed whispers. We sailed for many months across the edge of the world, preyed upon by pirates, storms, and disease. But as our leaky ships rounded the southern cape of Africa, we saw the first glimmers of the riches of the Orient. Three mighty citadels guarded the lucrative trade waters of the Swahili coast, where merchants traded ivory, Gold, spices, and jewels from the innards of Africa to the fringes of faraway China. Weathered by the long voyage, Don Francisco sought trade and hospitality from the first of his citadels. But her stubborn ruler, a usurper who had slain the rightful Sultan, arrogantly closed his gates to us. Finding an exiled African prince with ties to a rebel army, my captain cunningly hatched a plan to take the Swahili coast by fire and steel. Portuguese sure have the firepower. Looking forward to blasting them off the map. Let's see. Muhammad Ibn Rukn ad Din must survive. Bring Muhammad ibn Rukd and Din to the Swahili villages or bring him to Cuba for his execution. You are restricted to a population limit of 150. Bring Muhammad ibn Rukd and Din to Faxa, the center of Swahili villages, to raise his armies. Alternatively, you can send him to Cuba to be executed and gain the support of the Cuban ruler. The choice of siding with or betraying Muhammad, him you guess the same guy will have significant impacts siding with him will allow you to gather a rebel army on the mainland opposing him will make defeating Cuba easier but draw the anger of Zanzibar and the rebels Portuguese castaways and lost ships can be found throughout the sea gold is rare but can be obtained by sinking Zanzibar straight cocks can attack Zanzibar at will by changing diplomacy the Mutapa gold mines are somewhere in the west past the thickest baobab trees. Bring lumberjacks, lumberjacks to get to them. Somewhere in the west. Around this area right here. Probably. Storms have separated Francisco de Almeida and his son Lorenzo from the west from the rest of their armada. The damaged ships have reached the Songo Songo, an island off the Swahili coast. Cuba is the Sultanate nearest the Songo Songo. It's ruled by Ibrahim, a minister who murdered the Sultan and usurped the throne. He is opposed by an exiled prince named Muhammad ibn Araluk ad Din. The prince can be surrendered to Cuba as a bribe or brought to the Swahili villages to raise an army loyal to Portugal. The Swahili villages are held by Bantu warriors. Destroying the Bantu camps will end their raids. Mombasa, an island stronghold north of Cuba, is defended by a powerful navy. Zanzibar lies on two islands off the coast. While her fleet is strong, Zanzibar's small army makes her vulnerable to invasion. I like how Zanzibar is her and not him. Finally, the African telltales of the Goldfield Kingdom called Mutapa just beyond where the Baobab trees grow the thickest. The rebel prince promises us an army to conquer Kilwa, but he could also make an effective bribe to gain the city's trust.
Atacar! Let's bring him real quick, let's see what happens. The rebel prince promises us an army to conquer Kilwa. But he could also make an effective bribe to gain the city's trust. Alright. To the next stop. São as vossas ordens? Ao oh, seu entendido, farei do way. Sim, quais são as farei do way? Sim, entendi. Avançar as armas. Atacar. Para sim, entendido. Avançar. Para... Entendido. Entendido. Atacar. Sim, para... sim. Entendido. As armas. Sim, ao seu para... entendido. Ao seu disposto. Para... Sim, entendido. Farei do way. Okay, these guys lost again.
Quais são? Entendido. Para Sim. Entendido. Entendido. Para Entendido. Ao seu dispor. Quais são? Para Sim. I'm here for the shot. The warriors are scary. Go back. Right, we save the Quais são as vossas Sim. ordens? Quais são as vossas Sim. ordens? Farei Farei Sim. Farei Sim. Ao seu dispor. Quais Sim. são as vossas ordens? Sim. Farei Sim. Farei Sim. Farei Entendido. Quais são as ordens? Entendido. Ao seu Farei dispor. Farei Sim. Entendido. Farei o way. Sim. Ao seu dispor. Quais são as ordens? Sim. As armas. Entendi. Farei. Farei o way. Quais são as ordens? Sim. Farei o way. Entendi. As armas. Quais são as vossas ordens? A mão é que está lá. Sim. Farei o way. Sim. Isso. Que é o dado. Sim. Alright, heal up once again. Is this supposed to happen? Por Deus. Quais são as ordens? Farei, farei o way. Por Deus. Ao seu destino. Si. 
Sim. Ao seu dispor. Quais são? Sim. Quais são? Sim. E para aí, Ao seu dispor. Sim. Quais são? Por Alright, she up for the last time. Don't tell me this, the red is now going to attack me. Ao seu dispor. Sim, sim. Ir de é. Of course, he's so fucking stupid. Ao seu dispor. Sim. Ao seu dispor. Para ir, sim. Sim, para ir. Alright, show up. Once again. Start your mic. Sim, sim. Why sound? 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 Sim, 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 Is he supposed to attack me, though? Why can't he attack me? Why be a good Muhammad? Hey, what now? Destroy Cuba's castle. So how do we do that with what we are provided, if I may ask? Avançar! 
I don't know how we are supposed to cure it. All right, supposedly I have to find a ship with a bomber cannon. Which makes the mission very easy. And without a bomber cannon it absolutely impossible because as you may already know castles are the most important campaign buildings the AI dies to them but if you have to destroy an enemy castle it's so damn hard because their micro is so good now oh, I think it's somewhere around here this Transport ship. There you go. See a bunch of stuff coming my way. Oh, the monk died. The monk has died. Did we find? There you go. This is the annoying AI I am talking. Look at this. This skirmisher will run towards the end of the map. He's wasting my time. Anyway. What? There's no bombard cannon in here. Here is the bombard cannon. Everybody move. Sim, 
now if you have a condition like this you have to specify i, I know this is an old campaign but you have to say you have to find siege equipment somewhere on the map in order to do whatever whatever you know? Right. Come ships. These are annoying. As hell. These ships. Fight. Where are you going? I'm here. You disembark there. Ten ground. Ten ground here. But of course you can't reach. I don't like this scenario. I'm just saying the truth. I rarely say this. From the peace we have brought to Africa. I say this about one Sicilian scenario. But right here, what are you supposed to like? What's the point of this? You run around, you have to find something that isn't said that you have to find. You have to find the bomber cannon. Which like if you don't find it, the mission is impossible. If you find it, the mission is absolutely easy. Flees half naked into the forest. His silk captains alone will find And now you get everything. Like, uh, Troy Mombasa's wonder. Oh, 
Right, where is Mombasa then? Okay, okay, I take my words back. Maybe it's not as bad as I thought, but... I mean... The only challenge right now would be if Mombasa is... It wouldn't be like... There's no challenge. Because if they are... On the mainland, I go send organ guns and uh, and bombard cannons for absolute destruction. And if they are on the on the coastline, I just send. It's even easier. I send bombard cannons and all the stuff, all the good stuff, and destroy their wonder from sea. Yeah, now. Ah, there is Mombasa. So, I didn't manage to see if they are. If I can destroy their wonder by this from the sea. Anyway. Now you do the following. This army. How in the hell? Are these inland dogs? Now we get no chemistry, right? We get no gunpowder. Don't wululu me. Okay, no point building a town center there. Let's cut this up. We have access to the gold mines, but what's the point of having access to the gold mines? When uh, can build gunpowder. Can we make bombard cannons? No. Oh wait, we are we are in Castaway. Right, right. Can you go in? Not yet. And stupid, we are in Castaway. We get castles and everything. So my point stands. Just tedious to go to imp. Is still blocked. What? What? Man. 
Man. You just see what I'll do to you in a moment. Just wait and see. Yeah, just wait and see. Do have oh, what stuff? Yes, we gotta build a castle. Prevent them. From uh, entering this bay. And destroying our base before we are ready. Why Let's kill it, what? Why on? Have redemption and everything. I don't care, I'm going... Imp. You can throw your troops all you want at me. You just wait and see what is going to happen to your base in a moment. Okay, no more... Uh, Conversion of my stuff, please. This? To be having more gold here if the meat says that the land is full of gold and there are like four gold notes. Bro, there are like four gold notes in here. Monks are annoying as always. Why? 
Alright, get the caravel. This monk walking blindly for. Hmm. Does this technology give the cannon galleon? Hundred percent accuracy. Their lions, then there must be gold around here. Stupid lion. Okay, there's gold. Okay. We need this and time to make the ships pump. We are out of food. Last batch of caravels, and we go for some bomber cannons or some cannon galleons. I mean, Other upgrades for the ships can we get? I don't know. Let's try if this gets ballistics for uh, the cannon galleons as well. What? This is stuck. Have another relic in here. We could have, could have gotten some extra ships. They are getting stuck in the cliff, this is like Age of Empires 1 pathfinding. Oh, 
seu Sim. dispor e reconheço lo é. Quais são as vossas ordens? Okay, bring it, Mombasa. Malian Towers look cool, I've never seen them before. I mean, I have seen them probably, but not too often, haven't paid much attention. Yeah, nice ballistics for a... Gunpowder units, except ships. I guess Cannon Galleons don't count as gunpowder units Or maybe they do count, I think they do get Ballistics but Shoot It's not a hundred percent accurate Alright, enough messing around. Let's sink the rest of the dogs. But we don't even need to. You have destroyed Mombasa Star Wonder. Now nothing stands in our way. We have seized the riches of Africa and flung open the gates to the Indies with fire and steel. Yeah, something along those lines. Empires are built on the ruins of dead empires. The pile of burnt stone we left in Mombasa, once a palace. Was the foundation of the new empire of Portugal. Our conquest of the Swahili coast sent waves across the Indian Ocean to the wealthy trading cities of Zanzibar, Mogadishu, Calicut, and others. 
we were met with either fearful gifts or the closed gates of those with the foolishness to challenge our cannons. Yeah. Few oh. would continue to make that mistake. Portuguese cannons indeed are quite powerful. I have to say, but in fact, I want to play uh, a bit ranked with Portuguese. See the map orange yeah. stuff all around. And I mean, they told me I can plunder Zanzibar Stratcocks, but look how fortified they are. Do you want to mess with them, really? And Mombasa, well. Oh, they had plenty of stuff. But they have to specify. If you go by land, suddenly you'll find out that the wonder is here and you have to build up and hold together another fancy force. Tag them. Anyway, that is all for me for now. Thank you for watching and see you the next time.